why Indian developers always disappoint after getting huge funding. Indus sucks. It took years to develop. It's been such a scarfall too. Hai. Um, I don't think Indian developers disappoint. I don't think that's the case because a lot of uh, international games, their development happens here, or they use Indian developers to design and develop and uh, you know make games that are AAA titles that do very well. So a lot of the developmental work, a lot of the design work, a lot of the work does happen in India. So I don't think skill is the issue. Uh, there are other issues, but I don't know. And I I wish I wish it was. I wish it was different. I think we'll get there. It's very early still. I think everyone's trying to get there. It's not that the orgs or the devs or the game studios don't want to get there. I am two hundred percent sure that every single person at Super Game, uh, Super Gaming, and the people that are behind Indus are working tirelessly to make their game epic. But you know, it's it's they don't. Why would anyone want to make a bad game? That is my question. So if someone doesn't like a game. it also depends on audience taste you can't please everyone there is always going to be some people that like it and some people that don't like it and some people that like certain aspects of it aur kuch cheeze pasand nahi aati hai so that's that's always going to be that